Prime Minister, this Prime Minister, denigrated black men by putting a banana in his pants. Shame on every member over there that does not chastise them. If this were any other country, he would not be leading, and he would not have the moral authority to lead. He would not have that moral authority. Honourable Member, a question. I'm just curious if she thinks there should be consequences or uh, or retromand for members of this House who meet with known Nazis who spread uh, misinformation, disinformation, glorify the Holocaust, who speak against uh, uh, anti-Muslim rhetoric. Uh, I'm just curious if she's talking about online hate and privacy of Canadians and regulation. Does she condemn her actions by meeting with a known Nazi uh, in this country who spout anti-Muslim rhetoric? The Honourable Member for Haldeman Norfolk. The Prime Minister has put on blackface so many times. He has degraded black people. He literally put a banana in his pants. And you have the audacity, you have the audacity to stand and look at me as a black woman and ask about my meeting with another member of the European Parliament. That is within my job description. I do not have to, I do not have to approve of everything that another member believes in in order to have the decency to have meetings with with other individuals. Your Prime Minister, this Prime Minister, denigrated black men by putting a banana in his pants. Shame on every member over there that does not chastise them. If this were any other country, he would not be leading, and he would not have the moral authority to lead. He would not have that moral authority. And all across Canada, I've met people who value the same things. A good career that pays them well doing work they're proud of. The ability to live with dignity, to be who they are, to love who they love, and to be judged on their character rather than what they look like or where they were born. The belief that if they work hard, they can afford to raise their children and launch them into an even more prosperous future. And you have the audacity, you have the audacity to stand and look at me as a black woman and ask about my meeting with another member of the European Parliament. 